Welcome to Star Wars Jedi Fallen. No, no, it's not Fallen Order. That was the previous one. This is Jedi Survivor. Um, it's been quite a while since I played Fallen Order. I thought it was an all right game. Um, it was probably one of the best Star Wars games we got under Disney. Um, I'll give it that. And uh, it was fun to play. So this one looks a lot better. So I'm pretty excited to play this. I think it's going to be good. I hope. I hope it's going to be good. It looks good. So yeah, let's jump into it. I wonder how long this, how long after the previous one this takes place. I'm curious about the Jedi Temple, because we saw it um, briefly on the main menu. And uh, I'm wondering how much inspiration they're going to take from some of the expanded universe. Hmm. So are we arrested? gotta be sad to see now I'm pretty sure Palpatine used it like a museum or a base but I don't know uh, if they'll follow that entirely guess we'll see Seeing them go down into the Undercity, it makes me wish we would have got that 13-13 game. I, I will never forget it. And you know, it doesn't look as gritty as um, this parts of the city normally look in a, a lot of Star Wars. This looks more like something out of Mass Effect, in a way. Yeah, it looks a lot like something out of Mass Effect. Okay, this area, this looks, this looks about right. is unusual. I wonder how we got captured or if we even got captured. Yeah. I feel like this might be a show. Okay, this is when we run away, right? I always love these moments in games. You try to walk back and everyone just magically punches you forward. If this is Call of Duty, I'd be crawling right now, so they, you know, pushed me. What is this? You know, the environments look a lot more detailed than the previous one. I like that. Looks like there's a little bit more polish. Granted, it is the opening of the game, but, you know. Hello, officer. 
Yes. I'm trying to find my way out of this place. Oh, look, the guards are waiting for me while I have a conversation with the stormtrooper. Oh, there's a probe droid flying around. Don't tell me to get out of here. I'm just getting up in your personal business. I don't recognize your armor. All right, all right. <clears throat> yeah, I don't think I've seen their armor before. Yeah, we're definitely doing something. What's that? I guess it's just a light. This is cool. I'm a huge Star Wars fan, for those of you who don't know. Um, mainly Star Wars fan from before the days of Disney. So I've read, I've read a lot of the books, played pretty much every game made before uh, Disney took over. We got the scout trooper here. Just let me go. I, beg you. I want to see what happens. So they're just going to stare at him? Surely they'll do something. Although he is complying. He stopped talking. Did they just... I agree. What's the hold up with them? Maybe they're waiting for us to pass. They're just being polite. Alright, let's keep moving. Level 2046 has seen better days. What was expensive? Someone's got to pay for it. The guy's kind of spasming out over there. Hey, hey, no, no looting. God, who is that supposed to be? I mean, it's definitely a, uh, what are they called? From uh, Utapau, a Powan. Oh, so it's a, it's a Powan senator, I guess. Hmm. Okay. Wasn't that kind of a, did it bum any of you guys out that they completely screwed up the Powans when they did uh, the Kenobi show? I, I was shocked that they screwed up something, like a major piece of lore. Just completely messed up the design of the character. I wonder if we can use the force to pull those down later. Sort of like a force unleashed we could grab the TIE fighters out of the sky. That was awesome. Force unleashed was such a freaking awesome game back in the day. So is there building an elevator? Funny, his personal office is an elevator. No, 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 no. I want to see what's all. Oh, they're not going to let me. All right, well, we'll go, we'll go in, I guess. The rest of you will stay in. Not most of you. Deals change. Not this one. I come along. They had to reuse that line, huh? Only you. The others must wait. Yes, one thing I don't like about Disney Star Wars is they love reusing all the iconic lines over and over and over and over. Or they um, slightly reword them. I wonder who this senator really is. It's a secret ally to the Jedi or something. This way, Jedi. What the heck? Why did he slam me into the wall? The senator requested I bring the prisoner to him alive. He is breathing poisoning. <sighs> District secure? Yes, Senator. It better be. Ada's dogs are always sniffing about. Mm -hmm. Jedi is a rare quarry these days. What else have you brought me? 
It's his lightsaber, right? Which we could easily just grab right now if we wanted. Yeah. I wonder if they increased the customization of the lightsaber. Um, it was it was pretty cool in the previous, but I would imagine they probably improved upon it. The renegade Jedi Cal Kestis. You have made quite a name for yourself. Sabotaging weapons depots. Disrupting supply lines. Flaunting this for everyone to see. The failed coup on Norset. That was your doing, wasn't it? What do you want, Senator? A confession? You already know I've been working with Saul Guerrero. Before I deliver you to the Emperor, you will lead me to the remaining Jedi. I can't. It's just me. <laughs> no use resisting. I'll find out one way or another. Sometimes all it takes is a speech. But in there, I have other tools at my disposal. Or maybe I'll just use this. Your master's lightsaber. Jaro Tapa, a traitor like you. Hmm. And to think one day our children will ask, what is this thing? This relic of a corrupt institution destroyed by its own action. He's technically not wrong about that. This is a trap a lot of us fall into, Senator. I'm sure the Emperor won't mind if I deliver you to him in pieces. What? Did you really think you could capture me? Got classified military intel stored on your yacht. And she just brought it right to me. <sighs> Thanks, BD. You burn for this. That's mine. So do we are we gonna kill him? Or are we gonna leave him? I wonder if we get to decide. That'd be cool. I would assume he's probably going to escape. <laughs> Damn it, he escaped. I knew it. Okay. Nice. Alright, so let's uh, knock one off. Nice. that all you got, Senator? I wonder if at this point, or in this one, if you can pick them up with the force and manually move them around, throw them off the edge. That would be pretty cool. Um, I know you could do that in Force Unleashed, but... I don't think you could do that in, in Fallen Order. Oh god, he almost did the same thing to me that I did to his friend. Oh, he's out of force. He has to recharge, apparently. Did I cut off his arm? Okay, how do I block? L1? Ooh, and dodge. Alright, I'm gonna have to get used to that. Right here, buddy. <laughs> yeah. Why does he not... Okay, where's my force bar? Maybe that's at the bottom middle. Yeah, it doesn't look like I can use the force anymore. You can cut them up this time. That's kind of cool. I don't think you could do that in the previous one. Yeah, I'm slicing off their arms. What the heck? I don't think... I don't think you've been able to, to dismember since, um, I want to say Jedi Knight, Jedi Outcast, unless I'm mistaken. Not so fast, Senator. Hit it, BD. Aw, I was hoping we'd grab it and pull it now back. It comes to us. Nope. Uh, it's coming a little hot. Oh, really hot! Hold on! Okay. 
And this is probably where we learn how to, like, shimmy across things. We gotta get to that yacht. Yep. Have to have our uncharted moment. That was a close one, buddy. It's not your fault. Catch up with the yacht. Yep. Damn, he climbs fast. What the heck? That's some pretty speedy climbing. Make Nathan Drake blush. All right. Very convenient. Also, I love how in every game, the uh, the things you shimmy on are always yellow. They're either red or yellow, one of the two. So there's a little uh, the video game language. All right, okay, let's open this. What's inside? Patience. Okay, so we got a new admitter. I wonder if any of the previous things you unlock in like the prior game, I wonder if any of it carries over. I'm doubtful, but it would be cool if it does. Use the force on highlighted objects. Now, here's the question. Can I bend it around? Oh, I was hoping it was like Force Unleashed, but no. Oh, well, it's, it's not a big deal. It's still funny how a game that's like, what is it, over 10 years old now? Still has features in it that have been far superior to even newer games. It's kind of crazy. The graphics may not be as good, but the actual gameplay is pretty awesome. Oh man, that sucks. Sucks to be him, I guess. Ooh. Press X while in the air to Jedi flip. Isn't it just a flip? No, it's it's Jedi flip. They dubbed it. Hope it's worth the risk. All right. You never give up hope, do you, buddy? Can we go in? Oh, that looked like an area we could break open, but I guess not. All right. Do we have an equal vision? No. Okay. I mean, it's pretty smooth. I won't lie. I mean, I'm not really having to struggle with climbing anything. It's pretty... The uh, traversables seem pretty smooth so far. I spoke too soon. Alright. Drop down. Okay. Jeez, was he was he this fast in the previous one? I don't I don't think he was. We can rest there. Oh, we found a campfire site. I'm calling them campfires for like Dark Souls or something. Alright, meditation points. Interacting with the meditation point will save the game and access several other game options. So it seems like it's the same as the previous one. Skill tree, yeah. I wonder what they changed in the skill tree. Hopefully you don't have to re-unlock everything that you unlocked in the previous one. Ooh, survival, lightsaber, or force. What is in the survival tree? This is different. Okay, so we, we don't know what that is. Oh, it's just, oh, okay. Interesting. Okay. Use triangle for a long... Nah. You know what? Can I save my point? I would, to be honest, I'd much rather save. Improve footwork. Aerial ace. Yeah. We don't need that right now. <gasps> Wait, we can view them? Oh, I'm going to see that. Okay. Yeah. All right, well, we'll definitely come back to that later. All right. Spend skill points. No, no, I don't want to. <laughs> I have to. All right, fine. It's one of those moments. They force you to do it. All right, we bought it. Okay, let's get out of here. Boing. All right, I guess we're heading that way, but let's check. Make sure they didn't hide anything down here. No, it doesn't look like it. I don't know how well they hide stuff in this one. I know in the first one there were a few things hidden out of the way. I would assume it's probably the same in this one, if not more so. All right. What are we looking for? Suspect's mail. Last seen on dock 27. My 
God, I love that they added dismemberment. I that was one of the coolest things about older Star Wars games. It just it made you feel like you actually were wielding a lightsaber. The fact that you just kind of cut enemies to pieces. Um, I think I don't remember if it was Lucas, or if it was um, maybe someone in the, de in the for the developers, but someone along the lines. Or at some point, people were like, yeah, let's remove it. Let's not do this. We want to keep it more family-friendly. And I know a lot of people at the time were upset about it. Squatter camp? Oh, it's just information. Okay. All right, can we get in here? Yes. Nice. Yes, it will. For me. L2. I wish we could do it on just the environment. So... That's one thing that Force Unleashed had that I think... I, I'm going to probably talk about Force Unleashed a lot, more than I expected to. But um, these little things where you have these cues where you can interact with the environment in this game, Force Unleashed, you could kind of just do that with the environment in general. So you could just destruct the things around you. So um, when the game is much more... I don't want to say on rails, but where it's very like, hey, hit this object, hit that object, and you've played the previous games that are a little more involved, it kind of makes it stand out more that you can't interact with the overall environment. But I'm not saying that's a bad thing. I'm just saying it does stand out to me. It's a completely different developer, so it's, uh, it's not like this game has anything to do with Force Unleashed. Holo map. Okay, yeah, let's look at that. Okay, so we can see where the collectibles are. That's kind of cool. Oh, this is cool. Still drifting. Did I miss anything? What is the red door? Blocked gates. Okay, so we can't go that way. And what's green? Available gates. Okay. Where was that gate? Oh, okay, yeah, I'm over here. So I gotta... It's where I came from is where that gate is. Uh, I should probably go back, shouldn't I? Let's go back. Wait, where did I come from? Oh no, I don't remember where I came from. Did I drop down from somewhere? Maybe it's one of those moments where you can't actually go back. Am I crazy? I guess I missed it. Oh well, what a shame. Press X to jump to ceiling. Okay. Alright, can we assassinate? Yes. Nice. Boop. Alright, can we reflect if we... Yes, sweet. Oh, it was literally walking me through how to do it. Nice. That's pretty cool. All right, which way are we going? Mm, can't get up there. Ooh. I see him. Switch lightsaber stances. Okay. This does seem to do less damage. Okay, maybe not. They should let you just do fancy moves just for the hell of it. Let's heal, let's heal. Oh, I don't have anything to heal. How do I get healing things? Because we are really low on health. I guess I can't. Maybe I need to craft them or find them. Hey, yeah. But no, what I was saying, you should. There should be like a button you can press during combat that'll just do like some sort of move, twirl the blade around, just to make. Because you know they do that so much in the films. It would, uh, it'd be fun. People would be probably be doing it too much though, but that would be enjoyable. Let's be real. Got him. All right. Can I jump to there? Yes. They definitely use a lot of these grates in Coruscant. Don't look down. Got you, traitor. 
Why is he so confident? Who could have foreseen this? What took you so long? Oh, you know, just hanging out, <clears throat> taking in the sights. It's been a while since I was on Coruscant. I don't remember this guy. Was he in the previous one? Mm. Thanks, Bode. If he was, I don't recall. Good job, Gustus. It's been a l I, the last time I played Fallen Order was when it came out, so I don't. Um, Remember it when as well as I collapsed. could. I thought this heist might be over real quick. Why make it easy for him? Huh? Where's the crew? Heading to the yacht. We'll meet him there. Okay. Oh, and Bravo said no comms. No comms it is. I mean, you sh if you're on course on, you obviously shouldn't. You're on the heart of the beast there. I think part of the reason I don't remember the story going, too well in Fallen Order is because, honestly, the story was probably the least thing I liked about Fallen Order. Ooh, a shortcut. Here's my shortcut, though. I wasn't expecting that. I wasn't expecting instant death. I assumed he'd do some type of fancy landing, but I guess not. He's not... Did you see that? His hair went up in the air as he was going down. That's attention to detail. That's pretty cool. Alright, so there was a door... Was it over here? Yes, the opposite direction. Okay. So it's right here. I wonder... It looks like it might be locked. Maybe not. Okay, great. Nice. Oops. Damn it. Ask BD1 first, Tim. I've asked him. He refills... Oh, whenever we meditate. Okay. That's good to know. What? Interesting. Wait. Your stuff... Hmm, that's interesting. I don't... What... I, I don't remember if that was how it worked in the previous one. That's a little more like Dark Souls. Going and picking up your, your souls, essentially. That's interesting. All right, what's in the box? Hopefully something cool. A switch. Okay. I'll take it. Okay, good. I actually wasn't expecting him to grab the ledge, so that's good. Now, if I remember correctly, there was another door, but I think it was it was locked, right? I love this map. It's really cool. So it's blocked. And the fact that there's nothing behind it tells me there's probably no way to get through that door. If I had to guess. So yeah, let's go back up. Let's see how fast Cal can climb a rope. Okay, he doesn't need to climb it. And Liz are probably starving by it seems like they really made this game a lot uh, smoother than the previous one. Like, it seems to flow a little faster. To tell you about the Corita job sometime. Looks like that factory stopped the yacht. Good. No gunships. Yeah, why is there no one helping the senator right now? I mean, I know the Empire didn't care as much about the senators after they formed, essentially, but... This is kind of ridiculous. In the capital planet, essentially, of the galaxy, and one of your senators... Is crashed in the Undercity and no one shows up to help. Alright, let's, uh... What is he doing? Oh, he's got a jetpack, okay. There we go. Hey, you know what? At least we're holding on to the robot, so the robot takes all the force the of the, the cable rather than your hands. That's pretty cool. I always find it funny in games where you are um, you just have your bare hands and you slide down a rope from, like, you know, 200 feet, and it's like, oh, okay. 
You, you actually have flesh on your hands still. Which, you know, it's a game, but uh, I like it when developers think about those things. Alright, so we definitely have a door up here. Run and jump towards... We can wall run? Nice. Who taught you to move like that? My master. Every time I fell, he got me back on my feet. Sounds like a good teacher to me. I'm pretty sure you could wall run in the previous one, but still cool. For us. Better us than God, yeah? <laughs> he can run on walls, but if a surface is wet, rare it's all over. Yeah, it's beautiful. Yeah, if there's even a slip and slides, <laughs> Cal's one weakness. Yeah. You know what? If there's a wall you want him running, he can do it. But if the pool party's happening, there's slip and slide. It's all over. Yeah, it's not gonna happen, guys. Alright, where are we going? Maybe we're supposed to run. Yeah. He can't run on all walls, apparently. Wait, how are we supposed to get up here? Hey, turn off the slip and slide, my friend. What are we supposed to do? Ah. Okay, fair enough. Impressive. Who needs a jetpack? Wasn't that impressive? All right. Another box. What's in it? Probably another lightsaber piece, if I had to guess. Coruscant paint. Now, can we change? Ooh, we can change it from here, can't we? Where? Wait, we can change his jacket color? Oh, that's cool. Oh, man, what do we want him to look like? Oh, we can change his beard. Oh, that's cool. Let's Let's keep the stubble. Wait, how many are there? I see one and 13. I guess those are the two I have. All right, and then jacket. Let's give him... Yeah, let's do the hermit robes. And we can change the color? This is really cool. You know what? I'm going to make him blue for now. Totally isn't going to make him stand out. Shirt. Wait, why did I not keep it? Oh, I have to equip it. Okay, that makes sense. All right, and then... I guess it doesn't matter if he has that on, but the pants... Hermit, yeah, let's keep hermit pants, and then we'll go blue. All right, and I guess... We can't, uh... One th I guess we don't have any, any hair. Okay. So I don't know how to change... The, the robot. I guess you can't... Maybe you can't change the robot here. Maybe you gotta do that at, like, a bench or something. Yeah, this 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 looks better, I think. <laughs> I don't know. Alright, let's, uh... Can we zipline up there? See that cable? This is cool so far. I'm liking the customization, and I haven't even really unlocked anything. Ropes, another one of his weaknesses. What's on the sign? I always love looking at some of the signs in uh, sci-fi games. Normally, they're a lot better than this. This is kind of... What, what even is this? It's like a weird frog just falling infinitely. Looks like something you would see in like a like a maybe a pachinko machine or something. I don't know. <gasps> water slide. <laughs> I like how Coruscant has all these water slides just for their civilians, you know? Because it's like it, it it can't be that it's just rain because where is the water coming from? We're underground. Why are these all wet? I'm confused. Maybe they are water slides. You know, who am I to judge? Let's move on. 
me check my map, make sure we didn't, don't miss anything. Coruscant and their water slides. Bucket heads below. No going around them. Then we go through them. Yes, we'll take the water slide. Come, my friend. Oh. He shot him off the roof after I knocked him down. That's pretty cool. If Cal runs out of block stamina, he will be temporarily vulnerable. Great. Haha, -ha, you're to charge. He also ran out of his, uh... Oh, sweet. Alright, let's call it. Trooper's coming. Let's get the drop on him. Sure thing. On your signal. Hold R R1 and then press square to ask a bode to attack. Okay. Bode, can you attack for me? Thank you for giving me permission. He wouldn't have been able to do it without my permission. Okay. You can fight. Yeah, you too. I don't speak binary, but I hear you, BD. Boing. Alright. Almost there. Alright, what's the plan? The yacht's just over there. Let's try up that way. Quit reading my mind, Jedi. Hmm. But how are we supposed to get up there? Wow. So you're telling me you can just move these signs with a... Uh, as long as you got a jetpack? Oh god, that was close. That was scary. Alright, well, we made it. Okay, what's this? local directory in case we ever need to come back and look someone up we we made note let's stop it's like you know we're gonna have a water slide party on tuesday let's uh check the directory so we can invite as many people as possible stances now i think i saw in one of the trailers that this game has dual wielding which is great i if i was in the star wars universe i would probably dual wield so uh i like that you can do that in this all right, let's... Do we need to rest to restore everything? Enemies have respawned. Interesting. That is... It is a lot like Dark Souls, isn't it? Hmm. It's kind of cool. My brother loves the Dark Souls franchise. Um, quite a bit. So I have to hear him all the time talk about, you need to play Demon Souls. That's how he talks. Exactly. All right. He's going to see this. He's not going to be too happy. Alright. What's over here? Nothing. Alright. Let's um, check our map. Make sure I'm not missing anything. Which looks like there is a blocked door. I wonder if maybe we have to come back to the blocked doors. Because if you look behind the green door here, you can see a room. Beh behind the red door, there's nothing. So I would assume that means you can either never go in there or you have to come back later. All right. Oh, actual stairs, no slip and slide. Almost Speed broke my legs. Let's avoid that patrol. Agreed. Why? I want to fight him. Hey! <laughs> Wait, can I tell him to attack him? Yeah, how do I do that again? R1. Oh, I want to tell him to do it. The thing is highlighted, but it won't let me. I wanted to pull a Skyrim where you tell your friends to attack a random enemy. And they're like, I can't do that. You keep asking till they eventually give in. Yeah, scan the table. I think they probably know we're here now. not the best last words to have. Same here. Did I miss the green door? No, it is... Wait, am I not actually paused? Well, that's, that's good to know. You can't pause the game. Press circle to quickly recover. Okay. I'll take it. Oh, man. 
I saw it coming. What? Okay, how the heck are we supposed to do this? Hey, can we pull ourselves up, maybe? I don't know how I made that. Alright, can we go in here? It's definitely a heal. You know what? I, I want to fight them. <laughs> he broke his knees. Alright, well, I guess we can't fight him even if we wanted to. He was down there. Was it just me or did you guys see that? He was down there hanging out with them. Hmm. Okay, so now we don't break our legs. Interesting. Press L1, L3 and R3 to slow enemies. We can slow time. Nice. We're a regular hero, Nakamura. Ooh, crap. Alright, you attack him. I'm pressing R1, but he's not attacking. Maybe I can't be blocking when I tell him to attack. I want to check out this car. Interesting. Very fancy. Can we steal it? Oh, we can't. Oh, he stole the kill from me. We make a good team. Dead end. Let's double back. Do we need to double back? I mean, it looks like I can go here. What is this? Found something. I, I wonder what these are for. Pyrite or Briarite shards. Continue exploring the galaxy to discover this treasure and who finds it valuable. Interesting. Alright, it looks like there is something back there, so let's definitely go get that. Oh, I tried to do like an air dash, but I guess I can't do that. I, it's interesting how his hair goes up in the air when he jumps. It's kind of cool. Crap. Oh, damn it. Damn it, I knew it was going to happen. It was like a painting for a second. It's like, imagine them having their, their hands together. Oh, why did it zoom in on the... When you die, you lose all your XP gained. That really does suck. Restore. Damaging the enemy who defeated you. This is a lot more like Dark Souls. I wonder if they took the inspiration that from a lot of people who were making the comparison and decided to lean more into it. My brother is going to love this game. He seemed like he was having fun. Okay, let's respawn. We'll find him. Imagine if this had the system that they used in, um, what was it, Shadow of Mordor? Where you had the, uh, the, the tiered enemies. That'd be pretty cool. Slow up. He got him, he got him. Damn it. You don't? I guess I have reflected back at him. What is this guy doing? Hey, are you trying to escape? Look, you should just go home. Take the car. Don't shoot him! He's giving up. All right, you can leave. You murderer. That'll teach him. <laughs> That'll teach him what for trying to leave. What a jerk. 
I'm I'm I don't know this guy, okay? Got him. I'm pretty sure my friend just knocked me into a guy. Okay, they damage you. I need to keep that in mind. Alright, what is this? Oh, interesting. Okay, so we need to use this to get somewhere. I see. Let's check our map real quick, make sure there's nothing here. Ah, uh, yeah, just that. Okay. Alright, so let's go ahead and move this out of the way then. I really wish you could actually grab it and, and manually move it where you wanted to. That would be cool. Turn the Jedi Temple into his palace. Yeah, that's what the Empire does best. Take something you love and make it something you can't stand the sight of anymore. Is he talking about Anakin? I feel like he would be an Anakin fan. That was close. How long you been working with Saw Gerrera? Not long. A few jobs here and there. But I could tell you impressed him. That isn't easy. I'm good at what I do, and I don't ask okay. questions. Let's check our map. Open doors. Okay, so it looks like not seeing anything ahead, but I guess we'll have to load it in first. L2 to grab ropes from afar. Nice. I like how he just hovers next to me, watching me. We went into the building. Oh, cool, 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 cool. What the heck? Why? What? Am I doing this wrong? There we go. I don't know why he wasn't grabbing it before. Hmm. You might be able to use that crane to get across the bridge. Hmm. Using the Empire's tools against him. You know, there's one cool thing about having it not pause, is that if the characters are talking and you pause to check your menu, you're not missing anything. Yep, it's a prank, bro. <laughs> what? I'm dead? Was I, I must have been low on health. Oh, the damn scout. We're gonna get him. Didn't stand a chance. I wonder if it auto-saved or if it's gonna take us back to the bonfire. Damn it. Okay, note to self. Don't die. We got a fight ahead, Cal. You know what? We do get extra experience for this, so maybe I should... I gotta remember that. Okay. You know what? This is going smoother. You. That worked well. tried to jump forward, he jumped down. No more jumping when you're hanging. New rule. Here's the guy that killed me. Oh yeah, what, what do you see? Ah, shortcut. 
Nice. I'm not liking this. Enemy contact. Let's take him down. Yes, yeah, slow time. Got him. Oh, you stole my kill. You never should have crossed us. Well, he's not wrong. What? So what is this? <gasps> is the broken? Go no, he's not broken. He's just stuck in the trash. Who left the gonk droid there? All right, is there anything in here? Any sort of treasure? No. It just takes us back. All right. Let's move out. Ooh, what's this? Hey, not bad. Another shard. That couldn't have felt great on our back. Red attacks cannot be blocked. Okay. Good to know. I don't know how I did that, but uh, it seemed to do a crap ton of damage. Did you just say that I'm valueless? I guess compared to a droid that has a financial, uh, actual monetary value, I guess maybe. That guy really didn't like you. Don't think he was a fan of you either. Hmm. I don't see a way up. Let's look around. What's here? Find something, buddy? What's he got? Ascension cable. Worker hmm. season for construction now. Can you repair it? Uh, cable's a bit frayed. Not in bad shape. Should be a quick patch job. <laughs> there just happens to be a workbench next to us. Perfect. So I heard you fought the Empire on Kashyyyk. Yeah. Hijacked a walker. And broke open an imperial prison camp single handed. That one was BD. Just the two of you. And some friends. What about you, new guy? You win this for the credits? Credits never hurt. But, uh. I have a daughter. Got it. Here as often as I'd like, but at least I can provide for her. So what is this guy? Is he Must just a hard. random rebel or being away from her? Because mm. her mother she's gone. Because there's not really much of a the Well, Empire I guess it I guess it depends on how much time has passed. Sorry. Taking a lot of people. More every day. <clears throat> You ever use one of those? I'll figure it out. It was a scrapper on Brock. <laughs> You've been through a lot for someone so young. Just trying to survive. Aren't we all? Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Hope you have a fantastic rest of your day, and I will see you in the next episode.